360 or 360 for all these students and we have to plan irrespective of an easy paper or a difficult paper, we have to groom them towards that. If there are one or two questions little out of uh, context tomorrow, then what to do? I think these are all, all of these they can prepare through counselling. Uh, how to tackle that paper. I think that mental stability, confidence level, if you can create in biology, however the paper is, they can move forward to physics and chemistry with more confidence. So please create that confidence. And a lot of children today, um, they, biology they feel is easy, right? Because they, they never complain about biology, which is a red flag. Even a student scoring 280 does not complain about biology. They're very comfortable. They say biology, I don't have no issues. I have read NCRT, but their scores do not reflect that. And that is definitely a red flag and that is where they need to improve. So biology is super important. Also in the reveal program model question papers, we are giving on par with that senior elite papers. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. So good luck. Good luck to everyone. Happy uh, Pongal, which is coming up soon. And I hope students perform well in these grand tests and gain that confidence. So after the IPE break, we can get started with uh, working. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So today we organized national wide biology workshop. And the motive of this is there are certain very key and ambiguous points which were given in NCRT biology. For that our biology experts across the country and here I am showing you the Gosala faculty who are the eminent faculty of biology across the country and they are having a discussion with the rest of the country Sri Chaitanya biology teachers. The major conclusions that we draw from here is how the student have to answer when there is an ambigu ambiguous line that comes from NCRT in the final NEET examination. So this is how precisely Sri Chaitanya work on the students to make them reach to the top level in any of the competitive examination. So now let us listen what exactly and how exactly the workshop is going on from the experts itself. Sir, each one of you please. Uh, this is Jagdish uh, from Goshala Bice Campus, Botany Lecturer. <coughs> now we are discussing about uh, the various ambiguous points present in the different parts of uh, you know almost all chapters including living, living uh, botany part I am discussing now. So we are analyzing like what kind of measurements we have to take uh, while answering the question by the student. See uh, when, when we read some lines it gives different meanings or different uh, diversions of uh, meanings we will be getting. So we are making some conclusion that the student should follow only one particular way instead of the, you know thinking in different ways. So in that way we are making some conclusion and finally by today evening we will come to a conclusion and that will be supplied to the, all the students. Yeah. Thank you. Hello one and all, myself Roini Gupta. So really it is appreciable that we are uh, forward here together as a team and working on the some minute points which may be considered differently by different people. But we have to give a one solution to our students to clarify the what uh, controversies can be raised and how you have to handle. So we should be on one single line for that thing. So I feel it will be fruitful for our student to become more strong and more confident in answering the questions in the NEET exam. That's my point of view. Thank you very much. When it comes to perfection, Chaitanya is always preparing the students to get the top ranks and getting those top ranks. We are actually here gathered nationwide via online and offline to get the things written in NCRT in a little bit confusing term to make that very clear to our students so that every one of them, every of our students can get the best scores in biology. Thank you. Uh, so here we have uh, many of our experts, zoology faculty as well here. Let us listen from them like why exactly we have met here today and what exactly is the meaning of this workshop? Sir, please. Morning, everybody. Uh, with reference to zoology, we, there are certain ambiguities. With reference to human physiology and some uh, ambiguities with reference to genetics, evolution, and also to the last, uh, it is the ecosystem, etc. 
टुडे वी आर गैदर हियर टू डिस्कस द एम्बिगुटीज इन डिफरेंट चैप्टर्स नॉट ओनली इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बट ऑल्सो इन द डायग्राम्स एज वेल सो आफ्टर अ लॉन्ग डिस्कशन वी कंक्लूड एंड वी फॉरवर्ड द सेम मैसेज टू द स्टूडेंट्स in different uh, campuses thank you good afternoon uh, today we gathered here in uh, goshala campus with the aim of uh, discuss on the points which are there in ncert textbook in the form of uh, certain ambiguities so to have a proper idea on those ambiguities and uh, to provide proper uh, idea clarity on those ambiguities to the student community all of us gathered today and uh, concluded those points and uh, we can have uh, Uh, better information on those ambiguities and uh, we can provide the correct information uh, which is uh, useful to examination point of view to the students thank you one and all okay fine so it is very clear that shri chaitanya will never leave a nook and corner to keep the child in the top notch in any of the examinations the major point that you know today we are all meeting here and discussing about each and every ambiguous point is look at this you know we have the strength of complete gosala here the eminent faculties of india across the country again the eminent faculties of sri chaitanya different campuses we are having a discussion and when hundreds of faculty meets and lot of r&d happens there comes the conclusions and these conclusions are only the ones which are keeping the children of sri chaitanya to top in the neat or jee examinations that are happening every year and i'm very sure the conclusions that we draw will not be confined only to shri chaitanya but very soon we will also draw them on our youtube channels or any other social media platforms that shri chaitanya have to be accessed by everyone whosoever coaching they are you know studying in so that they can access and learn and get enlightened with the knowledge that these uh, enlightened teachers are sharing for you guys and all the very best i am very sure that very soon we will come up with physics and chemistry workshops as well and they will also give you a lot of information to upgrow your scores in your coming neat examination of 2026 thank you and thank you everybody all the best all the best